like a milli rocket Skin clear, still look young, Andy Miller knock it. money in my pocket, don't call me a money pocket Engine get to rock it, it sound like a thunder rocket I still love my baby even when it's toxic Crazy like she Britney, but no, she don't shade the knock Russell what's the way I get long, stay in the pocket I get paid and do my dance like a touchdown I can't do no time, only that gun around With Ryan's quest line finally completed, we're sporting some drippy steeds, but still a bit underleveled. I finally caught onto the OP grinding zone that is the bird farm. Next, I farmed some smithing stones, upgraded my weapons and summons, and grinded out a few levels on my way to level 100. That being said, before tackling the capital, I think it's time to do a little cleanup and get some more side quests under my proverbial belt. Back in the Tombs War catacombs. I did not know there was a rune counter on this game until like yesterday. I, hey, dude, I'm a genius. I mean, oh, idiot. That it? What are you gonna do? Oh, yeah, I can do that too. Well fought. It's about time I headed off. I'll see you again, warrior, should the fates deign it. You gotta think I'm crazy if you think I'm trusting uh, Drip Sullivan and his his lean potion, dude. I'm not giving her that shit. No. Wait. You have felt the curse. I can smell it on you. The box, yet tender. Apparently, my seed bed is ripe and waiting. It was a brief respite, I must say. Go and unshackle my corporeal flesh, trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. I can kill you and defile your corpse. Then the pox will truly be your own. I'm not down for any of that. I'm not down for that. No. I don't think I will. You've received the wisdom of the two fingers, have you not? Then I bid you welcome, as a true member of the Round Table. I am known as Gideon Ofnir, as a tarnished who wishes to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord. I am accumulating knowledge, to be all-knowing. You now belong to a select group of fellows. As such, I ask that you remain constant. Uh, you. What is it? Unlocated demigods? I understand you've been speaking to Nefeli. She's <laughs> my daughter. Sorry, she buddy. When she lost the guidance of grace. Though a mere axe-wielding barbarian, her youthful credulity suited my purposes. Don't be talking about so my daughter. Like work. That. Do not hesitate to employ her. Should her services benefit you? Despite her looks, she is more than capable in the press of battle. Watch yourself, buddy. Oh, so that's where the so-called Lord of Blood was hiding himself, eh? A fitting little squat for that deluded maniac to bleat about the revival of his precious dynasty. While he turns our fellow tarnished into bloody fingers, let him stay there. That way... 
His delusions will remain as they are, distant and unattainable. But perhaps it's worth <coughs> looking into. If what I've heard is right, then maybe. Ah, my apologies. Lost myself for a moment there. The information you've shared is of great value. As promised, your reward. Stop. It is a wondrous thing indeed. You are a true fellow. All I ask is that you remain constant. Constant, motherfucker. There are four more demigods yet to be located. Nicola of the Halig Tree, the Unalloyed, his twin, Melania, the undefeated swordswoman, Luna Princess Rani, daughter to Renala, and the one only known as the Lord of Blood. Rani is said to have cast aside her great rune. So here at the hold, we seek the whereabouts of the remaining three shard bearers. If you should learn anything of these matters, I'll trade your findings for a hidden treasure or a long lost right known only to me. We both desire to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord. As such, I hope we are compelled to work together. I think I'm a little old for that though, buddy. <clears throat> they need somebody young and hot to be the new Elden Lord. Sorry. Me, young hotness, you old busted. Okay, I need some adventure. I want to be good at the game. I want to kill a dragon. Elden Lords can kill dragons. They can. They have to. There's no way they can't. Godfrey could kill a dragon. I bet he does it every morning. Put you in there. Something anyway. Cheap shot, cheap shot. Oh my god. Oof. <laughs> Put me down like an animal. He's not that tough. I think I'm just a, a phony. A big Elden phony. Okay. Okay, fine. This will be the ever jail that I leave alone. This will be the one. This will be the one. For sure. You aggro. <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything about that. Hey, baby. Oh, it's you. Well, what do you make of it? What's happened to this village? I witnessed a sight much the same in my infancy. The oppression of the weak. Murder and pillage unchecked. A waking nightmare made by men. Hey, not all men is bad, baby. I'm good. I'm good for you. But this time, I'm a woman grown. And though the suffering cannot be undone, I can still mete out justice. <clears throat> justice to the oppressors. Let the scars I carve remind them. I am Nefeli Lu, 
warrior. What's up, my boys? What's up, my Albanuric boys? Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Ooh, self defense. Just splat. Looks like a Friday night, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Just stop. I don't want to kill all of you. I'm chilling. I'm chill. Oh, God. I'm getting covered. In See you Monday. <laughs> oh, my new armor, dude. Does this come out of fur? So what is an albanura? Bro, that is so... That I'm not gonna... I can't. <laughs> what is this nut blood? Nut blood village. Fun place to visit. Wouldn't want to stay. What a suspicious job. Please no, dear me. Huh. <laughs> I haven't a clue. No secrets lie with me, not a one. Oh, please leave me be. Wait then, you're not one of them. Well, what a relief. You're all fucked up. Are you even talking? <laughs> oh, goodness me. I am Albus, an Albinoric. As you can see, we're finished. The whole village is finished. The curse mongers have destroyed everything. No one that remains has their wits about them. I beg you. Would you look after this medallion? You must keep it out of the curse mongers hands. Halig tree secret medallion. And if you should meet the young Albinoric Latena, then please give it to her. Hmm? A chosen land awaits us, Albinorix. The medallion is the key that leads to the city. It's only a quaint treasure for we who cannot make the journey. But for dear Latena, it is needed to fulfill her purpose. Ooh. <laughs> Hello. What am I summoning her for, though? Dude, whatever, whatever's coming, dude, it's got a problem. Oh, you got two me's and an Apiley? Let's... bodies yo are all the lights out what's up mm -hmm. fuck was that I thought she couldn't fight here or something didn't they say that didn't they say something like that oh, you please Leave me be. It's pathetic, I know, but I... I need to think. Ah, you. Please. It's pathetic, I know, but I... Well, I guess she needs, needs space. Gentlemen, if you're ever having woman problems, go talk to her father. She will love that. Uh, you. What is it? Ah. Uh, you've already heard. Indeed, it seemed the whelp harbored suspicions, so I had no further use for her. Honestly, what's a man to do? A determined plebeian is more wicked than an omen horn, quite frankly. I suspect that's just what the Queen wants. A dose of ambition to incite the tarnished. What the fuck is he trying to say? Did he, did he cast his daughter aside? What a bitch! Oh.
Why are these chairs so incredibly destructible? Ah, you. Please. It's pathetic, I know, but I... I need to think. Man, we can come up with something, girl. Oh, okay. So you know already, do you? Right. It's true. My father cast me out for indulging my emotions. Forgetting the mission. Punishment for offing his pawns. Father. Mother. Lord Gideon has offered me guidance all my life. I would have done anything for him. To place him on the throne of Elden Lord. And yet I... Though it was not my intent, I betrayed him. And I... Can no longer trust him father. To think he'd order his men to Thank you, such tragedy. by the way, uh, Sneaky. Just as he purports in that, he once told me that if he became Elden Lord, he would never allow the downtrodden to be cheated ever again. Was he simply lying to me? No, no, no. How could I say that? Father has always given me his guidance. And now, I've lost it. But you got me! Give her my summon? I haven't even tried this thing out yet. Lucky, I love you. Is that ash? I can smell the ancient storm in it. My thanks. I'll what an old storm storm. I'm not like Broderica. I don't feel the presence of spirits, let alone see them. Still, this ash, it reminds me of my first hawk. Thank you. Dude, shut up. Shut up. I am simping. Dude, sometimes you gotta simp to get what you want. Didn't you see? You saw the Randy YouTube video. I was simping that whole time. Oh, Lord. The potatoes on the flow. Moonvale? Like the katana everybody talks about? It's that easy to get it? It's gonna be some warning in a minute. I've been through some shit, buddy. I don't think you want this. <laughs> okay. Dude, I love being over level for stuff. <laughs> he was great, alright. A pleasure to see you. A pleasure indeed. I am Gary, a great sage. In my day, anyway. I'd hoped to ask a favor when one of your ilk came along. A strapping young tarnished, able to cross the Scarlet Swamp of Aeonia. Don't fret. I'll provide fine recompense. Should you accept, I will teach you the secret of Celia, the town you see there. Ah, then you are willing to lend a hand, are you? I need your help to heal a certain young girl. Her name is Millicent. You will find her beyond Celia, resting at the church atop the cliff, stricken by the rotting sickness. The rotting sickness that afflicts Millicent has no cure. When the Erd Tree flourished, even the demigods could not stave off its effects, despite their nigh godhood. But Millicent's suffering can be ameliorated. For this, you are to find a certain needle. Seek the deep, scarlet swamp of Aeonia outside Celia's bounds. 
The needle, made from unalloyed gold, is lost somewhere there. This is a marvel indeed, the work of a true artisan, a meticulous, bold craftsman who grasps the essence of life. Can you give me some time with this? As well made as it is, it won't be much use snapped in half, will it? I have awaited your return. The needle is repaired. Now it will forestall the rotting sickness, I'm sure. Will you give it to the girl? Millicent, <coughs> I will reward you in kind. Sure, buddy. Millicent rests at the church atop the cliff beyond Celia, the town yonder. Tended to by the witless pests who worship her, or rather her rotting sickness, as a god. A wretched fate, indeed. The poor girl. You. She never wished for any of Doing that. This place felt familiar to me, so I decided to pay a visit, hoping to find someone here. Dude's gone. But I've only found emptiness. Perhaps before my departure, I needed someone to say farewell to.
mimic Harry so smooth sailing for me. The scarlet rot has stilled since last we met. As such, I've been able to continue my journey. Though rather vexingly, I realized that if I still had my sword arm, I could have aided you in battle. Are you giving me this arm? <sighs> Thank you. I am in your debt yet again. I think... If the arm serves well enough, it might be possible for me to wield a sword again. If the arms... It might be po Perhaps then I can aid you in battle. Well... Not a tip you want Not what I came up here for. Well... What?! What is going on?! Just, just, yeah. Stop. Look what I can do. Finally made it. And there it is, finally. Level one. Yeah, yeah. This world get cold, get frostbite, trying to find you a purpose. Yeah, yeah. There is no cheat codes to this game.